The 8th century inscription of Azadawada, also known as the Karatepa inscription, recounts the deeds of the great king Azadawada. It is notable in that it contains a bilingual format, written in both Phoenician and the indigenous language of Luwian. A number of familiar features stand out from the text, such as the mention of the Old Testament God, El, also called Elohim, the sons of God, the storm God Baal, references to molten images, and a series of blessings and curses. The inscription reads, I am Azadawada, man of the sun, servant of Baal, whom, Awariku, king of the Adonites, has made powerful. Baal made me a father and a mother to the Adonites, and I have restored their city. I have expanded the land of the plain of Adana from the rising of the sun to its setting, and in my days the Adonites had all good things, full storehouses, and prosperity. I filled the temples of Par and added horse to horse and shield to shield and army to army, according to the will of Baal and of the rest of the gods. I shattered those who were violent and removed every wicked person within the country. I built palaces for myself, made my family comfortable, and ascended to my father's throne. I made peace with all the other kings and caused them to sit on the thrones of their fathers. Indeed every king reckoned me among the fathers because of my righteousness, my wisdom, and because of the goodness of my heart. I built strong fortresses in all of the outposts on the frontiers and the places where wicked men were gang leaders. None of them had been a subject of the house of Mopsos. I, as Adawada, placed them under my feet. And I built fortresses at those places, so that the Adonites might live in them with peace of mind. I made vassals of the lands in the west, which the kings who were before me had not been able to subdue. But I, as Adawada, subdued them. I brought them down. I exiled them to the frontier in the east, where I have established the Adonites. In my days they were on all the frontiers of the plain of Adana, from the rising of the sun to the setting of the sun. In places where there had been fear, where a man was afraid to walk on a road, but in my days a woman could happily twirl spindles according to the will of Baal and the gods. And in all my days the storehouses were full, there was prosperity, the living was good, and there was peace of mind for the Adonites, as well as for all the plains of Adana. I built this city. I have given it the name Azadawadia, for Baal and Rashap, god of the goats. I built it according to the will of Baal and according to the will of the Rashap, god of the he-goats. I caused it to have full storehouses, and prosperity, and good living, and peace of mind, so that it might be a protection for the plains of Adana, and for the house of Mopsos. In my days the land of the plains of Adana had full storehouses and prosperity, and no one among the Adonites was discontented. I built this city. I gave it the name Azatawadia. I established Baal in it, and offered sacrifices before all the molten images. I sacrificed an ox daily, and at the time of plowing, I sacrificed a sheep, and at the time of harvest another sheep. May Baal bless Azadawada with life and salvation and mighty strength beyond any king, so that Baal and all the gods of the city may be served in Azadawada many days and years. And may this city possess full storehouses and wine, and may the people who dwell in it possess oxen and possess cattle, and possess full storehouses and wine. And may they give birth to many children and grow into a powerful nation, and may the many serve Azadawada and the house of Mopsos according to the will of Baal and of the gods. Curse now, if a king among the kings, or a prince among the princes, or a man who is a man of renown, wipes out the name of Azadawada from this gate and puts his own name on it, even if he has good intentions towards this city, but tears down this gate, or makes it into a new gate and puts his name on it, or if he tears it down with good intentions, or if he tears it down out of hatred and malice, Mael, the Lord of heaven and earth, the possessor of the earth, and the eternal sun god and the whole group of the sons of the gods, wipe out that kingdom and that king, and that man of renown. Only may the name of Azadawada endure forever, like the names of the sun and the moon.